Oh. Habs Fan TV here. Uh, we're inside the Bell Center. Um, honestly, I, I really debated whether I should even be coming tonight because you could have copy-pasted my last video and it would have been applicable to the same thing here tonight, but just in more dramatic fashion. The Canadians lose tonight 5-0 to the San Jose Sharks. And it was the same mistakes repeated all over again. We had, we had needless penalties again, which cost us on so many occasions. Caulfield got his penalty. At the end, Chiaro gets his penalty. We get scored on. There, there's no positives today. At least last game, I could tell you that there were some positives from Jonathan Drouin. This game, just nothing. I, and it's, I have a smile on my face because it's almost laughable at how bad it's turned. And I think we, we kind of forget that last year was kind of exceptional. And before the point where we end up reaching the playoffs and we go on to have a magical run, the Canadians were playing exactly like that. Exactly like that. There is no shock in my eyes from the way that they're playing, but you'd think that today was supposed to be a turnaround. And you'd think that, well, at some point, well, the guys, the, the group is going to gel together. We got to give them time for sure. Hoffman, he had his first game today. I don't know. He took a penalty. His, his help on the power play, I didn't really see it. And... I guess what we're thinking is to give Dominique Duchamp more time, but now we're 0-4. We're Some people are already calling for tanking this early in the season. It might be a bit premature, but with how bad they're playing, and again, it's just very structurally. You, you see that there's no cohesion in the team. Their, their trios don't necessarily gel together. You have individual moments from people. You have Josh Anderson sometimes getting a shot off or... You know, towards the end of the period, of the third period, they suddenly realized that they were down four or five goals and they decided to start playing. But it really just, it wasn't good enough. And it's, we're relying on individual moments from players and it just doesn't look nice on the ice. And uh, they're going to need to find a way to turn this around. And the blame, the blame is to be placed ultimately, I think, first on the players. The players really are not playing to the level that we know that they're capable of. The offense especially, but especially the defense. Uh, again, Savard, not good enough. That savard Chiaro pairing is going to be a major problem. I don't know what you do with Savard. I don't know what you do with that pairing. It's just bad. And you tell yourself, okay, well, Edmondson's coming back, but is that really going to make a difference? No, no. The defense is just not good enough. And we were lucky to have a giant in Shea Weber, He's not there and the Canadians need to learn to live with that because we can't go into games conceding two goals in the first four minutes of the game. It's, it's, it's a joke. We took five shots in the first period. It's a joke. It's a complete joke. So I expect some major, major changes. If it means bringing up people from Laval, Ryan Feeling, the other, the other game for Laval had a few goals. Maybe it's time to bring him up. Maybe it's time to just get things going. But that's pretty much it. Those are my thoughts. Uh, leave a comment. Drop a subscribe. Uh, we're going to be out here. We're going to be getting the fans' reactions, uh, seeing what, uh, what everyone thinks. But I think it's quite clear what everyone thinks. Uh, like, subscribe. My name's Alex. We're going to be out here again. Habs Fan TV.